Hi, I'm Hannah. And I'm Bing. And welcome back to the fourth episode of our Sex Ed series. Today is all about sexuality and sexual orientation. Sexual orientation is basically a system of labels made up so that we can categorise and understand people better. As Lacey Green says, labels don't define us, we define labels. Sexuality is fluid and one really good example of this is the Kinsey scale developed by a guy called Kinsey, which is like a orientation... Spectrum. Spectrum. It really only exists to illustrate that there is no black and white and that it is very actually hard to be entirely gay or entirely straight. So here are some basic definitions. Heterosexual. You are sexually attracted to members of the opposite sex. Homosexual. You are sexually attracted to members of the same sex. Bisexual. You are sexually attracted to members of both sexes. Asexual. You are not sexually attracted to any sex, but you can form romantic attachments. Pansexual. You just love everything. And all of them are awesome. All of them. Yeah. They're great. They're fine. They're dandy. But Hannah, how do you know? If you're confused as to whether you're gay, straight, or bi, or whatever, then it doesn't really matter. Some people will kind of know straight away from quite an early age, but for others, they might discover their sexuality quite a bit later in life. Hannah's actually had quite a few questions on her Tumblr, which there is a link to in the description if you want to ask questions, about whether you are too young to know your sexual orientation, and really, no, that's not a thing. You can never be too young to identify, and at the same time, you have to bear in mind that it's not like a permanent thing. You don't have to label yourself and say, okay, I am now internally straight forever. And you can't go back and- I am now time. absolutely hardcore gay, 24 seven, the gay will roll. <laughs> it's not like that, you can, you can choose when you want to choose, you can identify as you identify when you are mm. feeling it, and you can change your mind. If you're quite young, a lot of people may try and tell you that it's just a phase and you'll grow out of it, but you decide your own sexuality, nobody else does, so just listen to yourself. You also decide your own phases, and if it is a phase, then it'll be a phase, like yo-yos. Ooh, I like yo-yos. If you are confused about your sexuality, then just take some time to get to know yourself and understand what you like and you don't like, and there's no pressure to decide. You, you don't even have to label yourself at any point, it's just completely up to you. Society works so that everybody assumes you're straight unless you state otherwise. You can't come out as being straight. No matter who you're coming out to, your parents, your friends, your love interest, it's gonna be a little bit scary, probably. Don't be ashamed of who you are, because there's absolutely no need to be. And if somebody has trouble accepting who you are, then that's their problem. Yeah, and you don't have to listen to it. Obviously, if it's somebody that you really care about who isn't fully accepting you, that can really hurt. But it's about communication still. It always comes back to communication and being patient and helping them understand, and you understanding them, and generally just talking. Talking is good. I like to talk. As usual, the information in this video is very basic and it's full of our own opinions, so if you would like to know more about the kind of stuff that we're talking about, there will be plenty of links to further reading in the description. And since both me and Hannah identify as straight, we can't talk from experience on a lot of subjects. So if you have anything you want to contribute to this discussion or add to what we've been saying, then please, it would be really great if you could leave some comments or even a video response about your experiences. That would be fantastic. The next episode is going to be about the anatomy of the human body. So if you have any questions about that or any topics you would like us to talk about, then let us know with the links in the description or in the comments. Boom. Bye. See you next time. Is that it? Yeah. Oh, and that's cool. the sign off. Okay. We don't even have any funny outtakes. No, nah, man. There we go. <laughs> that's outtake gold. <laughs>